Hello again, my acquaintances, and welcome back to my Let's Play for Super Mario 64. In the last part, we tried getting the red coins in the stage where you unlock the flying cap, and I constantly and constantly failed. But I unlocked the red cap, so we're going to be skipping over that star, and just doing the... Uh, and we're gonna get the last star, the last two stars in Bomb on Battlefield. Um, yeah, this is. Where am I going? This is my second time actually recording this episode. The very first time, um, about five minutes into the recording, the sound, the sound for the game cut out on me for some reason, and it also cut out in the recording too. So I just deleted the recording, and now I am redoing it. And this is literally like. Um, maybe two minutes after I finished recording the original, so I'm kind of not happy. Like I recorded like the full 15 minutes, even though the sound cut out at five minutes. Because I was hoping, I was hoping Fraps maybe still picked up the sound for the game, but no, I just it was gay as fuck. It didn't. Um. Okay, let's. Uh, Get to this tree, which I totally freaking missed. Get up there, Martin. Fuck! Okay. I have like the worst aim ever with freaking cannons. Um, I still think my flying is worse, but. Yeah, my aim isn't too good with anything, really. I just have terrible aim in general. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> that was close. We get the red cap here, then we have to go into the cannon. Oh, no, Mario, I pound into the cannon, thank you. And we have to try to collect the middle coin in each of these rings. There's quite a few of them. I think there's like five or six. Now we are to fly back to the, the island, break Mario's head again, get a new red coin, jump back into the cannon, and blast off again. And we are going to continuously do this until we get each of the middle, the middle points. Whew, got two there, that's pretty good. Oh sweet, I actually got that. Didn't take us. Oh, whoa! Ooh, that was close. Didn't take as long as it did the first time. Here we go. Mario likes his peace signs now, doesn't he? Save and continue, and we're going right back into Bomb on Battlefield, and we are going to do the sixth, and for this, let's play the final star in this stage. There is one more star after the regular six that you can get, and it's in every stage. By collecting 100 coins, you can get an extra star, but I'm not going to be doing that for this for this let's play because I don't feel like, I don't feel like getting every single star. I'm not I'm not gonna get the, the 100 coin stars, and I won't get most of the uh, sorry. I won't get most of the secret stars either. I'll get a few of them, but I'm just not patient enough to get all of them. Kind of, I was like, I like this game, but I also kind of want to move on to another let's play. Like my friend requested, uh, my friend requested me to do. Um, Oh, fuck you, good brother. I'm kick your asses. You! Yeah. My friend requested me to do Fire Emblem 8, which I believe is the Sacred Stones on the Game Boy Advance. I'm not sure. I will check that out after I'm recording this. Done recording this, but I'm pretty sure that. I'm pretty sure it's Sacred Stones. I think that would be a pretty fun Let's Play to do, though. A little boring, because it's. Fire Emblem. Like, I'm not saying Fire Emblem is boring, but it's a little slow paced. And we have got this star. This is one of my least favorite stars to get in the game, just because Chomp Chomp usually kicks my ass. 
So that is it. We are done with the very first stage in the game, Bomb on Battlefield. And we are going to move back to Womp's Fortress and get the last two stars in that stage, which are both very easy to get. Um, oh yeah, also, not doing this stage. My least favorite stage in the game. Might get one or two coins. Um, coins. Might get one or, one or two stars in there, but not any more than that. I just really dislike that stage. It's my, probably my least favorite in the whole game. Uh, okay, we're doing Fall onto the Caged Island, where we have to get this um, owl, which for some reason reminds me of Kabora Kabora, even though it doesn't, like, talk a lot. It's just an owl in an N64 game. Kabora Kabora. If you don't know, Kabora Kabora is, in a very, is a very annoying character in The Legend of Zelda Aqua. No! No! Oh, I, oh wow, I just almost killed myself. Yeah, but Kabora Gabora is a very annoying character in The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. It's the name of, um... Uh, he's this owl. Who's... just talks a lot. He, like, he talks way too much for his own good. If it was possible to kill him in the game, I would kill him without a second thought. And he... oh, pff, how did I move? He moved. What is that? That's not right. This was so easy to me. This was so much easier for me to do on my first recording. I did it on my first try. Uh, but... I also, I kind of feel like doing, um, uh, have you guys ever heard of Mario Fresh? Wow. Just, ah, uh, fuck my life. Have you guys ever heard of, uh, Mario Frustration? It's this really, really hard Mario hack, or at least it looks hard, I haven't played it myself yet. But I also want to, uh, I also want to do a game of that. It looks, even though it's hard, it looks pretty fun because it's so hard. I think it would just be funny for you guys to hear me rage my ass off. Okay, come on, come on. Oh, oh, come on! Fuck! Hey, Gabora, Gabora, get your ass back here. Get your feathery ass back here. Thank you. Okay, now that star is done and over with, and we are going to do the final star in Lost Fortress, which is Blast Away the Wall. Which is a very easy star to get, but at first you might be like, well, what? How, where is this star? How do I get it? But as soon as you figure out what to do, it's incredibly easy. Here, I'll show you guys what to do in a second here, as soon as I get over to this, so... Um, cannon! Yeah. But pound that cannon, Mario. Ass fuck that cannon. Okay, you have to shoot yourself at that wall here. And as you find out, it's a fake wall that contains a star inside of it. Deep inside it. <laughs> Kill him. Here, you know, my throat hurts. I, I I don't know why. All right, first try. It took me about two or three tries. Um, actually, no. Last time, in my last recording, when I did that, I died actually, as I missed the wall when I shot myself at it, and I I flew I flew off the stage. Okay, so we have 19 coins. We 
are going to fight Bowser. Actually, no, we're not going to fight Bowser. That should go to this stage. As much as I don't like the stage, I actually do like the very first star. It's kind of, it's really, it's fun to get. Slip sliding away. Uh, what we do is go into this big ass chimney here. And we slide down. Let's get that. Yeah. And we, there is a shortcut. Oh, no. No. Oh. What? That was not the shortcut I was talking about, but okay, that helps. Wow, what, what the fuck just happened? Okay, we're gonna redo that, and this time we are not gonna fall off. Cause that, cause that totally misses the shortcut I was talking about. Okay, let's get the, the blue coin. Shortcut is right up here. Fake wall, and I totally missed that one up. What is that? I missed that one too. What is that? Come on. Okay, but yeah, this shortcut brings us right to the end of the slide. I would have totally raged if I missed that one up too. But as you can see, we didn't. And that is slip sliding away, people. And that brings our total up to 20 stars. Mm, hurrah. Actually, let's, we, we still have a good about two and a half minutes. Okay, we're not doing that. <laughs> I know the. It says. Um, a little penguin lost, but we're actually going to do a different star now, which is racing this penguin. The bitchy thing, though, about racing this penguin is that you cannot use any shortcuts, otherwise he'll just call you a cheater and you won't get the star. I think. At least I'm pretty sure. <sighs> oh, come on, come on, come on. Knew that was gonna happen. Okay, well that has been this part. I don't feel like trying again. Goodbye.